guys, let me just say welcome to Vlogmas Day 1. I know I said that I wasn't going to do Vlogmas this year, but I'm going to try to do it for you guys, okay? I'm going to try. I may not have a lot to do or a lot to say because I really don't go anywhere that much. Most of the time I'm home. But if it means I have to sit in front of here, me and Mr. Frosty, no, it's not snowing outside, but it's cold and it's raining and... So, I thought it was time to bring Mr. Frosty out for a while. He wanted to come out and play. And he wanted to come out and meet his cousins. See, I'm wearing his cousins today. <laughs> Timu, I love these. I just love these. <laughs> so, anyway. Um, first off, let's go through what I'm wearing. I told you, I'm not going to take it off and show y'all. I'm just going to show you on. I've already showed you there, here, somewhere. I've already showed you. So... Um, let me just, okay, I'm going to move over this way and I'll put it here where Mr. Snowman is while I talk about it. The hat came from, um, Dollar General, as I told you on the thing, my jiggy. There we go. And the shirt, again, I got from Timu and it says, blessed by God, spoiled by husband, protected by both. And it's loose. It's big. I ordered a big one. I like when it comes to sweatshirts or um, I just like them cozy and comfy. So I want them big and loose. And too, if it's really cold and uh, I need an undergarment, I could wear a tank top or something underneath this. And then, of course, the pants. Let me show you the pants. Here's the pants. You see these? I got these. These, I don't know what material these are. I'm just not sure. It's a spandex like... It's a silky, I want to call them faux leather, but they're really not. So, I really don't know what they are. And then the shoes. There you go. Shoes are from Shein. And I love these shoes. I need to clean them up a little bit. I usually clean my shoes. Once I take them off, I clean them up. But I haven't these. I think the last time I wore them, I just put them up. I didn't clean them. I was in a hurry. Don't ask me what I was in a hurry for because I really don't know. <laughs> I just really don't know. <laughs> I have no excuse. I just didn't do it this time. Okay. Now, yesterday I was cleaning. Let me tell y'all this. I was cleaning this room, the video room, because there's just, I've thrown things when I was doing try-ons, didn't put them back, my shoe, you know, just stuff. So I was back here cleaning and I was picking up, bending over, picking up, you know, doing stuff. And all of a sudden I went up just, you know, I was bending over and I went up and when I did, my back caught. And ever since I've been walking like this and I laid in the floor this morning, Daniel helped me. I laid in the floor, brought my legs up and that loosened it up. And I've just been walking and it hurts to straighten up, but I've been doing it because I've got to do it. I've got to get it out, get it, you know, get it worked out. I guess I just pulled a muscle, guys. I guess. <laughs> I didn't really know. Let's put it up a little bit so we can see Mr. Snowman. Mr. Snowman, bring me a dream. Bring me the cutest thing you've ever seen. Have Y'all you, remember that song? I'm drinking ice cherry lemonade. Love, love these drinks. I just love them. Just love them. I'm addicted to them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm so thirsty. And this is five calories. It says zero sugar. With vitamins and antioxidants, but zero sugar, but five calories. So y'all figure that one out on your own, okay? I do want to show you. I changed my watch band. I've had this one. I ordered this. I don't remember. I was going to say I ordered this from AliExpress, I think. But it's just, it's red lips. I love it. It's Christmassy looking, right? Because y'all know me and my red lips. Well, I really don't have red lips. I usually use, I usually do orange lips, but today... It's red, okay? It's red. So, anyway, I'm doing the red, and I'm doing this little shiny bracelet. I can't remember where I got this one either. I want to say Timu as well, but it's so cute. And then, on this side, I'm wearing my Christmas bracelets that I got from Shein. It's got the Santa Claus on it. Here's the Santy, Santa Claus, and the Christmas tree. I showed this to y'all when I hauled it the other day in the snow. Snowflake. And I love them. I think they're adorable. And then, 
the mail just run. Daniel went out and got it for me because it's raining. It's nasty and it's so he went and got it for me. Okay, okay. QVC. This is one of my Christmas presents. Daniel and I don't usually last year instead of under the tree, we did stocking stuffers for each other. But we both got in the stocking stuffers before it was Christmas. We just do that. I mean, you know, we do things for the kids and put them under the tree of the grandkids and stuff, but we just really, for ourselves, we usually get what we want during the year. Like, he's already gotten his. He got his. Well, he's got uh, golf clubs. So, this and the purse that's on its way is coming. That's coming is my Christmas. So, this is part of my Christmas present. And I'm just going to open it now because I'm going to wear it, okay? Because that's how I roll. This comes from QVC. And um, I went ahead and opened it. Because I wanted to see it. I couldn't wait to see it. It come in that little baggie. But inside this little box. And this box reminds me. And this says ultra fine silver jewelry. Made in Italy. This, uh, the Tiffany. This reminds me of the Tiffany box. Tiffany color. And that probably, that probably. And then you open it. And it comes in another little, little, pretty little bag. And here is the card, Ultra Fine Silver Jewelry. And this says, Ultra Fine Silver has been crafted to deliver a high concentration of silver, most distinguishable for its bright white color. This specialty 950 silver alloy, alloy, whatever, delivers a unique silver standard not typically found in the marketplace. In addition to its brilliant and vivid silver color, Ultrafine offers a durable finish set in unique Italian design. So, there it is. And I can't remember how much I paid for it, but I'll put the link to it below if you want to go get you one. They they had three different ones. This is the one I chose. Comes in this. And again, when I pulled it out, it was in that. But I went and took it out of that. So pretty. Let me see if I can hang it where you can get the gist. You probably can't even get the gist of it. Because as it moves, it's real shiny. It's got ba it's balls. I, I liked the balls. Look at this. Isn't that pretty? Oh, it's so pretty. And then it's got the little chain. And it doesn't, it's kind of hard to do. And I like that simply because it's not going to slide down. I hate it when you get those and they slide down. It just drives me crazy. So let's put this sucker on, and then I'm going to show you what it looks like. How beautiful it is. Okay, here we go. I got it to wear on the watch side, because my, my Fitbit watch is silver for the most part, unless I have the black cover on top of that. Then it's all black. But I got it to go with that and this. And I know one is a costume jewelry, one is a fine jewelry, but you can mix it. It's okay. It's okay. Just don't worry. As a way girl says, it's okay. Don't worry about it. It's all good. It's all good in the hood. That's what Marcia says. <laughs> so anyway, isn't that pretty? I love it. I absolutely love it. So that was one of my Christmas presents from Dan the Man. That again, I got early. And we probably don't do Christmas like most couples. Which, if you're a young couple, we used to do under the tree and do all that stuff. But, you know what, we're old. So, we want to enjoy our stuff, like his golf clubs. He got his in, and he's been golfing with them. So, there's that. It's all good, as long as we know, right? Oh, I put that back in there. And, again, that shows the picture of the some of the jewelry. I didn't put my nails on yet. I was just too lazy last night. After I hurt my back, I was done. <laughs> Stick a fork in me. I'm a done. So anyway, I know I order a lot of costume jewelry because I like costume jewelry. I love costume jewelry. And some of it you can't tell if it's costume jewelry or the real thing. You really can't. Um, this one, this one I'm wearing, it is so, um, if the light hits it just right, it shines like crazy. See my little coffee cup? I don't know if y'all can see it or not. Y'all see that? <laughs> Hang on. I don't know if y'all can see it or not. My little red coffee cup. It says Merry Christmas. Isn't it cute? But anyway, I love it. I got it to wear with on my watch hand. And yes, I will still wear 
this one as well because I just love this one. And I may mix a I may mix a gold with it. I mean a red. Okay, let me just show you. I got these from um paparazzi. And who's to say that I, I can't just take one of them out of the whole set and just kind of pair it? Or I could take the whole set and just kind of dwindle them in between, you know, like this, to the red would match and go with the, my good jewelry, the other jewelry. You know, you can mix and match anything, people. And the paparazzi jewelry now, you get a whole, you get a set of four for five bucks. All the paparazzi jewelry is five bucks. And it's it's like boutique jewelry. It's really um, good jewelry. It's good jewelry. See, aren't those pretty? And they would go real good with my watch. I don't like anything back behind the watch, but I could do that as well. And just pair it all up. There you go. I prefer the watch to be the last thing. And I can just do it that way. And look how pretty the paparazzi jewelry looks. With my my fine bracelet. It looks really pretty, don't it? See? You can pair it up any way you want to. Just because you, you buy a set doesn't mean you have to wear it as a set. You can just take some of it off and just wear it like that. Can y'all... Get a good look at that. Okay, but this one is just, I love it. I love that one so much. And I could always put that one in the front. Put this one in the middle. Uh-oh, I'm getting them tangled here. Oh, Marcia, don't do that, Marcia. Don't do that, Marcia. Marcia, don't do that. There we go. Isn't that pretty? And I like them both dangling. See, this one, right cheer is my as my granddaughter says, right here. See this one? The shiny one. I told you it's real clear. It has a little clear dangly thing on the bottom. But it just goes, I mean, you can wear two of them. You don't have to have just one that dangles. I like more than one. So, here is all my, look at this. I am all christmas up on my, on my arms. Do y'all see this? Here we go. Show my snowman. Okay, there's that. Sorry, my nose is running again. Guys, I have a cold. I'm sorry. It ain't going nowhere. But anyway, I wanted to share my uh, QVC bracelet with you. QVC has some good jewelry. Um, now, I did buy a ring from them one time, and it was silver, and it had a little J dangling for Johnson. I, they didn't have an M, and I wore it for a long time. Well, probably about a month, and the J fell off, and I couldn't find the J. I guess when I was in town somewhere, it came off. So, if the little dangly rings, if they're real dainty, and, and don't get them because you can't, there's no promise that they will stay together. I love my earrings. I just think my earrings are too cute. Don't y'all? Don't y'all? Don't y'all? Anyway, there's that. And if y'all want to do a little, I thought I would do a little what's in my bag with my Hackadoss because a lot of people want to know if it, how big it is. So, let's just do that, okay? Mr. Snowman's going to keep you busy till I grab my, my bag, wherever I may have put it. Who knows? Oh, sorry guys for the moaning, but my back is still sore. Okay, here we go. This is the Hackadoss that I showed you guys. It's a, I want to say it's real leather. It's very nice pebbled leather. And I'm going to open it so you can see how I have stuff in it. And I'm going to put it down so you can see what's in it, okay? I'm going to put you down for a little bit. Now, I've got my readers in it. I've, this is all my lippies. I put my lippies in it because I would never find them if I, if I put them in there. And right now, I've just got... The Buxom uh, Summer Fridays and my new uh, L'Oreal lip pencil. 
And I haven't put any others in there because, again, I usually put them in there when I see what I'm wearing. And it would have been this, which what I'm wearing is the L.A. Colors Lip Duo I got from Dollar Tree. And then I am carrying my little uh, Pictar. That's what my phone, you know, slides in and I can hold it as a camera. I always have that in my purse. And then some Kleenex. And then some little tooth cleaners. These are my favorite. I've always, I love these because they have the rubber ends on them. And um, they don't tear your gums up like those others do. Pen I got from my surgeon. <laughs> um, Tide pen. My inhaler. And my leaves. And trident gum and ice gum. There's one side. Ice and trident. And clippers. My wallet. My keys. See, I I'm going to show you everything I just pulled out. And a lip. Or a, not a lip. This is a glue stick. I mean, a, this is a glue in case my nails come off and I'm out somewhere. <sighs> and it's empty. But I know it's a dark hole, but it holds a lot. Now, let me show you what it holds. Okay, it holds all of this. Every bit of this. All of this and even two phones. It'll hold, I could still put two phones in there. I mean, that's a lot for that little bag. See how easy that was? It just comes in. I mean, you can pile it in. And again, let me just show you how I pile it in. All the little stuff, I just throw down in there. I mean, you know, it's all good. It's all good in the hood, you know. And then my wallet, my keys, my lip, my Kleenex, my pig tar. I usually put it up against the front where I can just grab it. My gum and my phone. It'll hold two phones, but I always carry one phone and the other one that I vlog with is usually in my hand. So let me show you how it holds. See, it'll hold the phone. It'll hold the other one too. And let me close it for you. Let me close. Let me close this up for you. Okay. Okay. And again, I don't usually. Because it's so fussy. It's one thing. I don't know how people like the Birkins and stuff. I don't know how they mess with that all the time. Unless they just leave them open like this. Because it is pretty fussy. If you're in town and you're trying to get to your wallet. And you know you got to undo everything. And you're like oh my gosh really. So. Because you see how I'm having trouble right now. Getting this slid in. But if you don't want nobody getting in your purse. Then all you have to do with that <laughs> is go ahead and buckle it up because I assure you ain't nobody getting in it ain't nobody gonna get in it even if you wore this across your back ain't nobody gonna get in that because it's too fussy it's just you know there you go so I thought I'd just show you see how wide it is you got you got quite a bit of width in there in the bottom and it, like I said, it carries quite a bit. I mean, well, you've seen, it, it carries a lot of stuff. And it means a lot just to be able to put it across your... Again, I love sling bags. I love sling bags. And you can buy bigger sling bags. I found one on, I'm going to tell you this, I found one on Timu. That is a sling bag. And um, it's made kind of like the L, my LV bum bag fake but you know um and the white one that looks like the lv bum bag you know it's the inspired it's kind of like it and it's humongous now they have humongous ones on etsy if you want to pay 200 dollars, and i don't I, I don't so but this one on timmy is really cute and it's big if, if you just want a bigger one to put if you carry bigger wallets if you carry Everything but the dish rag, you know, in your purse. And I like that sometimes because, again, other than, I have it in my other purse, my tote. Other than um, the little pig tar, I do like to carry my little 
um, tripod. And then the little thing that screws on the tripod, tripod to hold my phone. Um, I like carrying it too because there's sometimes it's easier to hold in the store than it is the Pictar. So, I don't know. It just is. So, there's that little tidbit. So, anyway, guys, that's that's my uh, day one vlog. And I don't know how long it is, but it's probably not very long. Oh, I can't tell you guys how much I am addicted to these. So good. I drink a lot of water during the day. A lot of water. So I drink so much water, I get to where I need something that's got flavor. So I'll run and grab these. And most of the time, I'll just drink half and then put it in the refrigerator and the next day I drink the other half. Today I drank a whole one. But you don't have to tell nobody. He wants a drink. Glunk, glunk, glunk. <laughs> Mr. Frosty has come back to town. Back to town. I, and I am lo lo loving. I love, love these earrings because they're too stinking cotton picking cute. Okay? All right, guys. That's it for my video. I don't know how long it is. And I may have a few clips to add to it um, on my my camera I may or I may not I don't know vlog one may be short okay but I'll, I'll get my act together and I'm gonna try to vlog again I'm gonna try to vlog every day if I don't go nowhere then I may just be sitting here in front of the camera me and Mr. Snowman and we'll talk and if you guys like that idea just let me know okay just comment down below and tell me all right guys remember keep that in it and you'll always win it and I'll see you tomorrow Bye bye